welcome back to Voxify episode 7! Seven. Seven. Uh, I'm Jamie and my other host with me is Regine And we have another four special guests with us today Woo! Yay! Yay! Everybody clap! Woo! No, wait, wait Special guest and guest of honor. Oh, yes, go, la, <laughs> <laughs> Episode 7. Would y'all like to introduce yourselves, please? Okay. Hello, I'm Fion. I'm year two in MV. I'm MV's head of logistics this year. I'm in guitar section. My favorite food, I was told to say, is sushi. Particularly sashimi sushi. Ooh. Hi, um... I'm Ethan, I'm a year one in MV, and I'm in vocals and guitar section. Uh, my favorite food is uh, ramen. Wow. Ramen. Hey, my name is Azri, I'm a year one vocalist in Music Vox. Um, my favorite food will be steak. Yeah. Good choice. Good, Good choice. choice indeed. Good choice. <laughs> Hello, my name is Masha, I'm a year three vocalist and songwriter in MV, and I'm also Music Vox's vice president this year. Woo! Yay! And uh, my favorite food is lasagna. My name is Nigel and my role is MV's advisor. And my favorite food is any food that will nourish me. What? Amazing! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a banging answer. That's a banging answer. Like, <laughs> like food, put your mm. mouth and it goes in. Then the food gets pushed down the esophagus line into stomach central. Mad. Great. Thank you very much. Thank you, so much. Wow. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. I will now leave. Okay, now I'll introduce <laughs> our new camera gremlins. We got two more today. Calvin is still here. <laughs> Yay! Calvin, say Yay! Hi. Yay! Again. <laughs> and then Caitlin is here too. Caitlin, our president. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have Jung Yook, of course. Oppa. <laughs> okay, so to start off today's episode, we are going to play a game. Are you ready? Fun. Game? Okay, so basically, the game is called Guess the Song. So one of y'all are going to sit here, mm-hmm. and then y'all are going to act out the song, and then everyone else has to guess. Fion, let's go! <laughs> can go first. My the phone? My. The phone flying. Levitating. Ground. <gasps> oh! Oh. Okay, okay, sorry. <laughs> okay. Oh oh. <laughs> He's stuck already. <laughs> How you turn? Come on, telepathically re- pass it to us. What is that? <laughs> you right? All right. Songwriting. Song right? <laughs> Marsha. <laughs> Marsha Signature. No. Your hand. Coloring outside the line. <laughs> Mr. White. Are you for real? Are you serious? Lying. It's okay, I will get my game on right now. I will win with more than two points. What? He giggling. Why? Hey, it's three words. Three words. Oh, we got hint. We got hint. Yeah, yeah, it's three words. I think I know what it is. Circle. House. Us, us, we house. Our own house. house. Oh, I know yes. because I performed for DSEA. We house. We house. We house. We house. Oh, oh, we house. 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 <laughs> Baby, I love, love, <laughs> Baby love. <laughs> See, what? See, she's like just. It's not in the list. Baby, running, running through my mind. Travel, mind. Wow. Every wow. summertime, Nikki. Yeah! Oh, oh. <laughs> wait, wait. You wanna try oh. Jimmy? Give more difficult songs. You wanna try? Me acting? Yeah. Okay, okay, wait. Uh-huh. Heart. Uh-huh. Heart. <coughs> Happy birthday, Fiona. Jimmy, what are you? <laughs> what? Are we looking at the same Boy, thing? Boy, girl. <laughs> <laughs> no, let me restart, restart. Uh, okay. <laughs> what? Rawr. <laughs> <laughs> 
drawer. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh huh. Ah. We are girls. Yes, candy girl. <laughs> <laughs> candy girl. Girl. Bigger girl. <laughs> Lady. Okay. <laughs> lady. Lady. <laughs> Big lady. <laughs> huh? Wait, was what woman? Raw woman. woman. Can you do your roar again? Roar. roar. <laughs> yeah, because the sound's gonna help in it. <laughs> the the second word. Woman. woman. The second word. Woman. Dangerous woman. Yeah. Oh my oh. god. Sheesh. Oh my goodness. Jamie, what is this? Dangerous! Dangerous! Her dangerous is so cute, actually. It's not dangerous. Oh, I know, I know! It's a new LP. Jamie excited already. It's okay, Reggie, let's go. Trust in us. Very easy, you just need to point to one person. Oh! Shawn Mendes song. What Shawn Mendes song did Kelvin sing? Leave when you... No fair, he's Shawn Mendes fan! Yay! Oh, back, 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 so all or nothing Crazy round. One. All or nothing. Oh, we'll ask Junior to so guess. That's easy. Okay. Eyes. <laughs> Brown eyes. Hard eyes. Love eyes. You love each other. Saw. That uh, word. word. Ass. I saw us. I found us. I look us. Mm -hmm. Jamie, you can try doing. Games of us. Yeah. What? Oh my god, us three. Yeah. So I, didn't, I didn't understand the eye thing, but when she started crying, I got it. Because <laughs> that's been me on so many nights. <laughs> oh, no.
We are going to move on to our Q&A segment. Woo. Today's episode is a back to life episode. So Woo. we are going to be talking about shifting from the COVID times into the non-COVID or mostly non-COVID times. Slay. Nice. Okay, first question. How was it like to perform live for the first time? It felt amazing. It's like... Because when I first came to MV, all I wanted to do was like perform live. So being able to perform live was amazing. Fion, you did recording for the LP, right? Mm. For Spread the Light. And then you got to perform that song live finally again this year. So it must be like very special for you, right? Yeah, it was because the recording process wasn't easy at all. And like there were a lot of changes made. And now when we have to perform this song live, there were even more changes made. <laughs> but that's okay. It's still like a very fun experience to be able to, you know, be part of both the recording process and the live performance process. You can watch <laughs> us perform Find the Light Live. Tomasic Art here. Center. I'll put it here. For me, it was a bit different. Because um, I'm, the, I'm the youngest in the in the band so yeah this was like my first time performing live uh, right after induction came actually I got to know that um, I'll be performing for this uh, high stakes event and wow well, you know it took me away it, it blew me away and um, yeah it was it was an it was really overwhelming but really exciting and enriching experience I got to go for my first sound checks my first like um, my first previews it was a tough grueling experience but also I learned a lot from it uh, no regrets at all. I met friends, um, long term friends. Oh, no. Weird noise. <laughs> okay. I wanted to say like, but it came out. Maybe after that, not 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 Jamie lah. Um. My sister's right calling the mic. me. Oh, hold on. I'm sorry. Hi Shana. Hi Shana. Hi. <laughs> I'm back guys Hi Kay. Okay so um, Where was I? <laughs> At home for two years Yes I mean <laughs> <laughs> My first two years of MV Was spent all at home And like Recording at home Maybe in like Year two There was a bit of Things in person But it was Mostly like recording No live performances So in year three I finally got to like Perform And then perform like Original songs It was like Quite heartwarming la, to see like everyone come together, happy, happy, playing music. It's just very heartwarming to see. Yeah. For Masha, how did it feel to perform your original songs on stage for the first time? I think each time is always like different. La. I think the first time for Dreams, it was personal for me because it was like the first time I'm singing original songs on a stage. Just, Crazy yeah, uh, but I think it was yeah, it was really nice to see like people just enjoying playing my songs. How was your experience performing live this year? Very overwhelming. <laughs> <laughs> Please share more. <laughs> the Kuchang hit you too hard already, forget everything. <laughs> Like back my head. <laughs> oh no! Um, it was very overwhelming um, because yes, first time performing such a big for such a big crowd after spending two years in my room. <laughs> wow! This was the most exciting, but also like the most nerve-wracking part of performing on stage live. For me, the most exciting part was to see uh, everyone enjoy the performance. It's great fun when you're performing and you know the audience are actively engaged in the performance. You know so. For me, as a performer, that's that's what I set out to do. You know, make everyone happy with with uh, with the performance that I'm gonna put out. The nerve wracking bit would probably be more more the technical aspects. Like, um, as a vocalist, you gotta make sure that you know your your vocals stay stable, no matter how much you were jumping. And I was <laughs> jumping. <laughs> I was very Slay. very into it. As yeah. you should have. Yeah, of course. You know, that's that's my job as a performer. Um, and then, like, uh, of course, you know, where to stand, make sure that you're not out of position, you don't look too awkward on stage. All these little things that we need to pick up as performers, apply it while while performing. It's it's quite difficult and nerve wracking because uh, if you make a mistake, whoops, you know, it's 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 huge. But uh, we did it, and yeah, I'm couldn't be more proud of everyone. Yay! <laughs> <clears throat> For me, the most memorable like experience is just you know being able to be on stage the stage itself is a very like my god wow i'm gonna be performing on stage that's the exciting part of it but 
if we're gonna talk about the nerve wracking parts, it would be like, what if I forget my cords? Or like, what if the strap just comes off halfway? What am I gonna do? <laughs> or like, the stream snaps or something like that. Yeah, so these are like the tiny little thoughts that you'll have moments before you go on stage. Mm. But I think at the end of the day, like, being able to, you know, be on stage and perform a song that your band has been working on for so long, for like months, and being able to like hear the crowd like cheer and clap for you, overall the whole experience is just very, very rewarding. Yeah. Preach. Question, question. What if your <laughs> strap comes off on stage? <laughs> what will you do? Throw the guitar. Adapt, the overcome, improvise. Just yeah! Okay, so f- for me, the most mem- memorable part is um, probably picking up an electric guitar for the first time. It was, it was, at the same time, it was the most like nerve wracking at the same time because while well, it was very fun, like having the power of like distortion and everything. Power. <laughs> and then I had the like power because not you could. by myself. I think for me the most memorable thing is kind of similar to us. It's just seeing everyone um, performing, be it like MV performers or like DPD performers or like anyone performing at a concert like X and just seeing everyone enjoy each other's X is very like touching to see yeah on the contrary like the most nerve-wracking part for me is always like personally like just imagining that someone I know is in the audience watching you like <laughs> staring at your face you know but then it's like, been two years in your bedroom huh <laughs> <laughs> you know? yeah so I think that's always the most nerve-wracking part for me but we as Fionn said we improvise adapt overcome Woo! and Oh no! Oh I to say no. Yeah, we're gonna say bye bye. Thanks everyone for watching Voxify episode 7 and we'll see you in an 